Francis Hellman, APS President, and John Bagger, APS CEO, are with me right now. Hello, congratulations on this meeting. I know it was quite a task to get people here together. How does it feel? Oh my God, it's fantastic. It's, it's, um, it's actually now I'm choking up thinking about it. It is just so fantastic to be back in person and to be able to see people and interact and all the spontaneity, all the things that happen that just do not happen online. I love seeing the people. I guess I hadn't realized how much I miss it, but this is my first conference back and it is just wonderful again to reconnect with people after all this time. APS is tackling such important topics. And on top of all of that, you had to deal with the logistics of bringing people together. How challenging was that? And how did you keep your focus on APS and the issues of APS? This is a huge meeting. It's an enormous meeting. And pre-pandemic, it was already a lot of management to deal with 10,000 people. Then we pivoted into the virtual meetings, which was quite an impressive pivot that the, uh, that the APS staff managed to pull off with the help of the many, many volunteers as well who participate. And then pivoting to this, which is this, which is a hybrid meeting, is simultaneously exciting. You know, John has, has spoken eloquently about the importance of being able to do hybrid, the accessibility for people who really either can't come because of COVID or just never could come. Yeah, and so this is now actually the largest March meeting we've ever had between the combination of the people here in person and the people viewing remotely. So for your level of experience attending this meeting, if I'm attending for the first time perhaps, the tenth time perhaps, I want to know what is the don't miss session from your perspective? So this is this does more than one thing, which is the, kind of the great part. It has a, just an extensive set of invited sessions but the other side of it is the contributed talks, which are short, they're 10 minute talks, and they're really often unpublished work, just brand new things that people are excited about. And then the final component is the hallways. You know, for me as a long time member, this is where I get to see all my colleagues and friends and catch up with them. And you know, for a new person, it's where they get to meet all the people whose papers they've been reading and they get to actually meet them. I'm really happy that this meeting is focusing on climate change because the Nobel Prize this year validated that physics and climate change are closely related to each other. And so we're having sessions talking about how physicists can contribute to the energy crisis, to mitigating climate change. And it's super timely. And it's also a subject that young people are really interested in as well. And so I think that's a integral part of this meeting. Great science at the meeting, great scientists coming together, which is so wonderful. Do you think that the model of this hybrid is something that will continue? We would like it to continue, and we want it to continue precisely because of the accessibility issues. It allows more students to attend because uh, it's expensive to come to a meeting and students can't always afford. It allows us to reach internationally as well, and so it really does increase the footprint of APS. Our mission is to advance and diffuse the knowledge of physics. What better way than to use modern technology to do it? Even to add to that, the industry folks, I mean, for many people who work in industry, their companies often won't support their coming to a conference. So they actually have to take vacation time to come to a conference. Mm -hmm. And here they can attend remotely. And, and so I think there, there is a huge benefit to this. Yeah, opening these doors can open many more doors in the future. <laughs> so Francis Hellman and John Bagger, thank you so much for being here. Well, thank, thank you. you. It's very our much. pleasure. Yeah, thank you. And congratulations on putting together a pretty great meeting. <laughs>